We're here today with Scott Weber from the Design for Xbox team to talk about racing wheels. Scott, how are you, man? I'm good. We got some cool wheels here to, to show so off from excited. our partners. I'm so excited. Tell me a little bit about this first one. So this is the Hori Racing Wheel Overdrive, and this is uh, kind of an entry point if you want to get into steering wheels. You know, it's it's only ninety nine ninety nine. It's got table clamp right here, and just pops right on, and uh, it's super easy to use. Nice. And, even if you've got a glass table or something you don't want to scratch up, there's actually suction cups right here that you can use without mm. that underneath there. So you can just stick that baby right on and, and get to racing. Let's get it Here we go. In the Halo in, Warthog, in the Warthog against real cars, there's no chance. Yeah. I feel like we need someone better to demo this, but what I can say immediately is it does feel more natural. Yes, definitely. These just plug into the console um, really easy. You can see the pedals there plug into the back. We have two pedals, well, two. Uh, Two pedals on a pedal system? Yeah, yeah. let's call it that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no. So you got your brake and your gas. No clutch. We're trying to oh. ease you into your first experience. I appreciate here, that, I do. As a lot of paint is being chipped off here and as we uh, plow well. through things in the Warthog, but come so on, you, you gotta fight a little it's, dirty. Yeah, exactly. Ugh. Rubbin's racing, son. Yeah. That's what that's what I was once told. We hit our second lap, which I think is a good time because I really want to try one of these nicer wheels, if yeah, that's okay. Definitely. We, we got a that? couple more wheels to try. Let's do it. Let's do it. So Scott, tell me about the major differences of this wheel because this thing is beefy. Yeah, this is this is a little different. This is the Thrustmaster TSXW Sparco P310 Competition Mod Racing Wheel. I got it. You see that? I got nice. it. Nice. That was good. That was good. That's good. So way different here, right? So this is a much higher price point. This yeah. thing is six hundred and fifty dollars. Got your nice suede wheel yeah, right here. Yeah. You've got uh, brushed. Steel on the base right there, it's very cool. And then you see on the pedals down here as well, you have your third uh, clutch option there. Right, which right. Is, which is very cool. Yeah, so. I mean, I can feel everything. Like you feel, it feels completely it's different just, than the first wheel. It's just like a, it's like a real yeah. racing, racing wheel. You got the Sparco branding there and everything. <laughs> it's, and it's gonna give you that feedback too, right? Like, a, Yeah, exactly. So this one's force feedback. So you'll really feel when you're coming through a turn, you start to feel that uh, yeah. car really fighting back at you. I'm already feeling the second gear. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna try and take a turn real fast and it'll, uh, it'll fight you pretty good. So you don't have to just play this on Xbox, though. These work with computers? Yeah, correct. This will work on Windows 10, no problem. Uh, and just like the first one, there's no all the buttons are the same. You don't need a controller whatsoever to play exactly. with this. Yeah, this is the same thing. A little bit different layout. So Scott, you said you have one more wheel for us, but I don't know how we, how you can top this thing. Like This already feels so beefy. What are, yeah. like, well, you just have to wait and see. It's, oh, yeah? uh, it's quite an experience. Right. So we're starting here with the uh, Fanatec CSL Elite Steering Wheel P1. Okay, so this is a very modular system. Obviously, uh, we have the cockpit right here that you can get on yeah. Fanatec, and there's a, a seat here and a whole thing. This is the whole setup. But really, at the base of it, you have this beautiful automotive-grade leather right here on the wheel. It's very, very cool. It's yeah. an aluminum wheel. Um, lightweight feels good in the hands. It does. Yeah, it feels, feels really feels good, good in the hands. Yeah, and then we have this wheelbase here, and they have a couple different options for the wheelbase. There's an elite wheelbase, and then there's um, some other ones too. This one right here is actually 600 for the wheelbase right there, and that's got the motor Jeez. in it, empowers the force feedback, gives you all that resistance yeah. while you're driving. I can definitely really nice. I can feel it. You yeah, know? I definitely can feel that. So, and then there's pedals. They have all sorts of different pedals. Those range from anywhere from 80. Uh, to 500 for pedals if you want to have like the, the best of the really best. the best the inverted setup like the racers use and all that <laughs> I still am not confident in my abilities as a like I, I do not do this thing justice and I really want to <laughs> yeah oh oh that was pretty yeah, sick see, that feels good <laughs> going 35 yeah this uh this force feedback's amazing because even uh oh even when I let go here you can kind of see it reacting. Look at that, I'm gonna gonna hit that. Start, boom, yeah. yeah, look at it's that. It's gonna start to yank it on you. Oh, that is awesome. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I got some tree, yeah. it's fine. Good, good. <laughs> this feels great, I love it, I really do. I'm gonna take this home. Is this is this an extra one, or is this? Uh, sure, yeah, why not? No, it's not an extra <laughs> one, we need Man. this actually, we really need this one. <laughs> Gosh. <laughs>